in this video i'm going to show you how you can create this amazing cool gradient effect on your buttons so that whenever you hover on the buttons then it changes its color and it gives it nice glowing gradient color right and this is going to be a css tutorial and i'm going to provide all the coding all the css snippets so that you can basically copy and paste it also make sure that you watch the video till the end because i'm going to do a live demonstration and showcase how you can change the color so that you can customize this as per your needs ladies and gentlemen my name is Pritam. i run a go high level web design agency and in this video i'm going to walk you through step by step so make sure you watch it till the end okay by the way if you do not know this uh, uh platform right is called go high level it's an all-in-one marketing agency platform it can be used for your own small business your own as a marketing agency or if you want to have your own white label SaaS program then you can also use the high level tech stack at the back end and sell it as your own white label make sure that you check out the link below that's an affiliate link and it helps my business and the youtube channel so that i can keep providing the content for free for a very long period of time right uh let's get back into the builder and let me show it to you right so this is basically the button that you normally get in the go high level builder I'll just get rid of that. So this is the button, right? And the basically to get uh, get this button is to click on this plus icon, just type button, right? And you will get a button, right? This is the normal button. And I'll just increase the size of it just to make it look nicer. That's it. Okay. And, um, and I'll just show it to you the codes. By the way, the code is available in the description box. So make sure you copy and paste the code, okay? Please note that you will be getting the exact same code which I am showcasing here so that you can copy it uh, and use it on your uh, own account. Okay. Um, what exactly you need to do is you need to click on the button that you want to change the color for. You want to go to the advanced section and then you, you see at the bottom it said in CSS selector. In this CSS selector, you only need to use this text, right? This is the ID. Once you have selected the ID, you go back on the CSS, uh, the code which I've provided you. And here, just have to remove these two brackets and add your own code, okay? Same we would do for this. And we have added, and now all the effects, all the CSS changes that we are doing is now will be reflected on that button, okay? Now, one more thing, if you just save it, you will be able to see that blue effect which was supposed to be there, right? But we are going to change the color so that you can also change the color by following this tutorial. For that, I have already created this uh, entire shade, right? And this helps us understand the two states of the button. When you see this button, so when you see this button, right? This is actually on the rest state and only when you hover on that, it changes the color and then it has a shadow which makes it feel that it is glowing, right? So uh, even this gradient in the rest state, it has a two color gradient, right? If you see on the top section, it's a bit darker and at the bottom, it's a bit lighter. So that's a gradient from top to bottom. Same happens when you hover on this, there is a gradient from top to bottom as well as it had a background or CSS color, right? This is basically the shadow, which is in blue color, okay? So I'm gonna take this on the rest state and I'm gonna give you a live demonstration of that, okay? So this has to be the top color on the rest state and I'm gonna take that hex code, right? And I'll go to the custom CSS, right? And here on the, the first part is basically where you change on the resting state of the button, okay? Here you can see that there is the first CSS, uh, the hex code basically, and I'll replace the hex code here, right? I'll grab the, diff the two colors, which basically make it a gradient, and then I'll add it to make sure that this is changed. Uh, then I'll add the hover state, I'll grab the hex code for the hover state and then add it here because this bottom one is for the hover state, okay? Same goes for here. Just grabbing the hex codes and then adding it here, okay? Now for the box shadow, okay? What is box shadow? Box shadow is basically that element and the glowing effect you saw around it, that is the shadow which is basically glowing and it has a color to it and that's why I'm choosing this color. It's good to use uh, choose a color which is on the same tone so that it makes it look very nice. And this is where you do it, okay? Then, so all the changes have been made, now I'm going to click on save. 
okay now as you can see the color has been changed and it gives a beautiful pinkish tone with a gradient from top to bottom and then when you take your cursor and hover on the button it also changes color it makes it a bit darker plus it has this uh, glowing effect around it right so that's how you create animated button buttons ladies and gentlemen uh, you can do some more customization to it basically click on the button right and then go to the advanced section then go to button effects and click on hover okay when you do this then it's not only going to change the color but it's also going to uplift when you are hovering on the button okay it's so simple and it's so beautiful right not just that you can select the button and then you can go at the bottom and then click on borders and then make it full border when you make it full border you can just take the border color to be something which is similar to that and then you can also make the border radius right this is what the same button is going to look like okay and when you hover on this it slightly decreases i mean it just makes it look so so freaking beautiful and uh, if you just preview it you will be able to see that the beautiful button is now live on the landing page okay so this is the normal state it has a gradient right already and then when you hover your mouse or your cursor then it it, it gets into the darker color because we chose the darker colors and then it has this glowing effect due to the shadow right the box shadow or here in this case you can call it the button shadow right so that's the tutorial ladies and gentlemen from my end make i hope that you really liked it and you're going to use the css again the css code is in the description box copy paste and follow my tutorial and make sure you subscribe to this channel to get more such amazing videos for your business thank you so much and i'll see you soon